Good evening! Thanks for tuning in to the Ginger News Network 9 channel at 6.52 p.m. I am your host, Ginger Snap, and you're live in the COVID kitchen. Oh, fo show. Not ho, fo show, but oh, fo show, night to night. How y'all doing out there? How are you? Welcome to the COVID kitchen. I gotta keep my microphone up to my mouth so you can hear me. Welcome to the COVID Kitchen, you guys. I'm so glad you're here. Happy Monday. Welcome, Monday. And it's, um, may I have my cocktail, honey? Mmm. Thanks, Mark. How are you? It's a beautiful day here in Atlanta, so I'm glad that uh, we got a little bit of sunshine, a little bit of warm weather. Happy to, um, be making dinner with you guys tonight. Hey Vince, welcome. I um, uh, am cooking whatever's in the fridge right now. Um, so I have a lot of veggies and some leftover meats. So I've got uh, some grilled chicken breast and I've got some chicken sausage that I'm gonna heat up and put in my soup. So uh, I like having soup because it's cold during the morning and then um, it warms up throughout the day, but I like having a good hot soup every day, and it's the way I get my vegetables. It's hard to get my vegetables uh, cooking at home just for one, so it's a much easier way. Um, I have a great pile of, I don't know if you can see it, but I don't want to tilt it too much, but I have carrots, broccoli, and baby portobello mushrooms tonight, and the good old celery to clean your bones out with. So um, you guys um, get the joy of watching me. Oh, and I've got some um, yellow onion in the uh, pot right now, and I'm just waiting. So if you're just joining me at the right time because it's starting to heat up here in the COVID kitchen tonight. I hope everybody had a great day today. I'm coming to you live from my kitchen into your kitchen. Hopefully you're having something great for dinner tonight too. So, I'm just glad to be a part, and I'm glad that everybody is here. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Hey, Lamar. You couldn't call me back, but you can join my Facebook Live. Hello. <laughs> I love it. I'm just giving you a hard time. I just woke up from a nap. Okay. All right. I'll give you that. Don't call me back right now. I'm, I'm Facebook Live. And, uh, hey, Fondro. Welcome from, uh, from Charleston, South Carolina. Good to see you. I'm glad I caught you. Glad I caught you at a good time. Hey, Wendell. Welcome to the COVID Kitchen. Um, thanks for tuning in to your 7 o'clock news tonight in the COVID Kitchen. I hope everybody's doing well. Staying safe out there. We've got some big news in Atlanta today. Hey, Haley and Brandon. Um, some big news. We, you better read the news today. Got some big news. Everybody gonna go out and get your haircuts. Go out and get that new do, okay? I got my appointment for next weekend. Um, so make sure you go out there and get your haircuts. And, uh, what is it? Haircuts and bowling alleys. <laughs> I mean, to tell you what, it is crazy. But, you guys, we are happy that we're here tonight, and I'm glad that I'm with you. And, um, gotta check on the neighbors, they're always spying on me. Well, I'm going live. I think they want me to, I think they want to be with me and you, you know, like, all right. Ouch. Okay, you guys, I'm just making a OFO show uh, dinner tonight. Um, just kind of cooking up a whole bunch of whatever's in the fridge left over the past week of COVID kitchen menu, so. Um, got a little bit of everything. Got my veggies, got my meats, just whatever's been left over, so I'm excited about that. Excited to be with you all tonight in the COVID kitchen. We're doing shrimp and grits. Ooh, that sounds great. Shrimp and grits. Just want to make sure I didn't miss any comments up here. Billy, Candy Cane, and Ronnie and Mark. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Glad you're joining in. Glad you're tuning in. Um, what are y'all having for dinner? Uh, I heard shrimp and grits in the comments. Let me know what you're having for dinner down there. Um, 
Did anybody do anything amazing today? Um, Atlanta, it did warm up, so that was nice. I was able to get out and get my exercise. I hope that everybody did your exercise today, too. Don't ask me how many steps I did yesterday because I don't imagine it was over 50. Um, bad weather and cold temps. Mm -mm. I don't do cold at all. If you know me, you know that I don't do cold. Ooh, smokes. It's starting to burn, honey. Ooh, we just want it to brown. We don't want it to burn. That's right. All right, put that in. Let that cook a little bit. Ooh, dokey. It's gonna get hot up in here, y'all. That's great. Hey, Daniel, how are you? Thanks for tuning in tonight. Glad you guys are here with me. I'm cooking an ofo show night. Ofo show, not ho. I see it now. It says the other way around, but don't anybody call me out, please. I'm a good stay-at-home dad right now. Hey, Mark. Welcome. Glad you are with me tonight. Woo, it's getting hot up in the cold kitchen, y'all. I mean, to tell you what, real hot. That's perfect right there, you guys. That's perfect. Perfect. Making spaghetti and steam stroh. Streaming Willie Nelson's 420 special. Ooh, girl, I bet that is good. I bet that is real good. What else is everybody doing tonight? Sounds like Willie Nelson got a special on. Can only imagine what's going on on there. I like Willie Nelson. He hasn't really done much lately, but I like him. Now we got all our, oh gosh, got all of our vegetables. I was just trying to pick the last of this cilantro. I just got some new cilantro in today, but I was going to try to find any that's still good and add it to this dinner tonight. It's just a kind of mix of whatever's in the kit, in the, uh, whatever's in the, Lost my train of thought. Whatever's in the refrigerator is what I'm having for dinner. Just a little bit of a mix of everything. Yes, sir. Hey, Josh. Welcome. You know, um, cilantro is one of my favorite herbs in the world. Not only is it good for you, it helps fight off virus which everybody needs right now. So if you're around some, uh, if you have the availability, get you some fresh cilantro. You can grab it from any grocery store and it's delicious and you can have it with a lot of meals. So, so definitely check it out. Get it in your local, local fresh food store. Hey Quay. What's going down for dinner? I'm late. No, you're just joining. You're just fine. I was a little, I was running a little late today, so, um, I was out getting my exercise and just enjoying the afternoon, you know, enjoying the, um, not the whole afternoon, but just the little time that I had for my walk. Um, so I came back and then I was talking to the neighbor and then, um, I just was prepping this so that I could come to you and talk to you guys, so. Um, but yeah, I'm having a little bit of everything that's in the fridge. I had some chicken, some chicken sausage. I had some good veggies, so I'm just kind of combining it all together, put it in one pot, and having it all for dinner in a nice hot soup. I gotta keep, uh, I gotta make it look like I haven't been eating all these home-cooked meals. 
So when I go, you know, back to the office, whenever that is, they don't say like, ooh, girl, you've been eating good in the neighborhood. I don't want that. I want them to think, ooh, he needs to eat something. That's what I want them to say, you know? So, that's looking good. Just gonna add my veggies, and then I'm gonna heat up my, heat up this uh, chicken and chicken sausage, and we'll be good to go. What is the spices? Um, I have uh, a whole little list of spices that I use. I love um, rosemary and uh, oregano and what else? Oh, I have three right behind me. I, I pull out of the cabinet real quick. Give me just a sec. Those are my fa three favorite ones that I put oregano in almost everything that I make. I love oregano. Can't go wrong with oregano. Okie dokie. Parsley, basil, and oregano. Oh, speaking of basil. You guys, I just got from, it's sold out everywhere, but I was able to get my hands on this beautiful, it's so petite, so I can put it in the palm of my hand. It is Mrs. Meyer's basil candle. Oh, the hand soap smells amazing too. So I just wanted to mimic that, but I wanted to smell it more. So I got this amazing, um, it's only a 4.9 ounce candle, but it was like seven bucks on uh, Amazon to Amazon Fresh actually sponsoring this video. Thank you so much, Amazon Fresh. Um, yeah, so I did another Amazon Fresh order today. I ordered at 11 a.m. and they were delivered by 4 p.m. That's crazy right there. I mean, that's just, that's incredible. Incredible. I didn't even have to go to the grocery store. So that's a lot of veggies for one. Well, uh, hey, Robert, welcome. Um, so, I'm, you know, I make a, this big pot so that I can enjoy it over the, you know, all week pretty much. Um, maybe one, you know, maybe a cup of soup at lunch and maybe something at dinner. And if I get bored, then I can just heat this up. It's real quick and easy. Hello, hello, Ginger Spice. Hello. So, yes, it's a lot of veggies, but I'm going to eat it throughout the week, so I'm excited about that. Okie dokie. Oh, gosh, everybody. I'm so glad you're all here. Let me just put this away real quick. Yep, I'm excited you guys are here. Really happy. Hope everybody had a great day today. Um, yesterday's weather was just crappy, real crappy. So I'm glad that uh, we made it through. Glad that everybody's here today and happy to be with you guys. So thanks for being here. Hey, Daniel, welcome. Glad you made it tonight, man. I'm running a little late tonight, but I'm glad you're here with me. Got my fresh cilantro going in right now. So excited about that. Cilantro is my favorite. Love me some cilantro. Okay, I think that's it right now. I'm just gonna let that start to boil so we're good there. All right, now I get to talk to my people. What's up with the scissors and the reverse plate behind you? Is that some kind of sign? <laughs> um, no, that's just, I dry my dishes back there. So I have a little, you know, just pull them out of the sink and uh, wipe them, you know, rinse them off. So um, I had actually opened up my Amazon package earlier. So I, um, and I used the scissors, so I didn't want you know, if they were contaminated, I just wanted to wash them real quick. So I rinsed them and, um, and now they're just drying. So that's where, that's why they go see scissors back there. Hey, Chris. 
Welcome to the program tonight. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Glad you guys are here with me. Oh yeah, we're starting to boil over here. That's good. That is a good sign, you guys. I'm gonna get this meat together and start putting the meat in. Mm-hmm. Quay, I just love talking to you. You're so much fun. I cannot believe it's been so long since we have seen each other. And you're in Nashville. That makes me so happy. I cannot wait to come out there and see you. If you'll have me. Uh, that would just make my day. All right, let's get this meat going. What are you making? We got a big pot of Ofo Show right here. Not Ofo Show, but O. See if you were to turn it around, you see Ofo Show. So it's uh, oh, it's just a little pot of a little bit of everything that I've had in the fridge for the past week, and I'm trying to get rid of it. Of course, I can't wait for you to come. I can't wait to get there either because oh my gosh, my microwave is making a lot of noise. Um, it's just gonna be so much fun. I've never been, and it's always been a place that I want to go and check off my bucket list. So. Yay. Hey, Colin. Welcome. Thanks for checking out your Ginger News Network 9 at 7 p.m. I am your host, Ginger Spice. We're in the COVID kitchen tonight. It's OFO Show night. OFO Show. Can you say that out loud? OFO Show. There you go. You got it. Y'all did great on that one. I like that. Well, did really good. All right, almost done there. Hey, Tim, welcome. How's it going? Welcome to the COVID kitchen. chicken sausage about to get cut up. Hey, sounds great. My chicken soup is almost gone now. Eight bowls served and about three left. Well, that's great, Jim. Glad to hear that. Sounds like you had some hungry parishioners tonight. It's always a good thing. Side of leftover meats, leftover veggies. Okay, all right. Making a whole lot of noise. Microwave don't like me tonight. So, just got a little bit of everything that I'm cooking up. Mm-hmm. I have to look at the phone every now and then to make sure I'm not missing anything. Ooh, it's hot. Real hot. You know what they say, you can't, if you can't handle the heat, get out of the kitchen. It's tempting me though. But if I left the kitchen, I wouldn't be able to see you guys. So that's the whole reason I'm here. Just to bring a little light and a little bit of happiness to you guys' lives every day. I love getting messages from everybody saying, Keep doing your videos, they're so much fun. Well, if they're fun to you, they're fun to me because um, I don't get, you know, working from home, everything's virtually, so it's nice to see you guys uh, in the comments there and I get to hear your, get to hear what's going on in your lives and all that good stuff, so it makes me real happy. And my neighbors are always trying to see what I'm doing here in the kitchen. They always want to know what's going on, so I like that. Ouch! That was hot! Oh, this looks delicious. Got my spinach and feta. 
stuffed chicken sausage and some um, chicken breast that I cooked the other night. Hey, Bobby Cole, this seems like a weekly occurrence that you'd be watching my shows. I like it. Thanks for tuning in tonight, Bobby Cole. Bobby Cole and I go way back, way back to when I was a little boy. Not that long, but a few years. We had a lot of fun. Steph and our guys. Okay, that's good. Glad you got some hungry people there today, Jim. I bet they're loving those cookies. Ooh, those look good. I got some new cookies today delivered. I just ran out. So, I was glad I got a new delivery. It's real hard for me, you know? I love my cookies. Cookie, cookies are settling so I can store them. Final one. Oh man, I bet that kitchen smells amazing. Absolutely. Yo, oh, I gotta show you this. See if I can see if this will come up on the screen. Can y'all see that? Woo! See the chicken sausage right there? Chicken breast on that side? Mmm. If you couldn't see it, I'm sorry. Mmm. So good. Good for you. Got that cheese stuffed inside there. Mmm. Just perfect. Julia Child, she would say, that's just amazing. I'm not sure what she would say, but I don't think it's that. I need to look her up. Yep. Ooh, that's looking good, y'all. I mean, it's, it's almost hard to stir. There's so much stuff in the soup. It's gonna be real good. It's nothing better than a springtime soup on Ofo Show Night. Y'all, I got this shirt at, um, guess where? Guess where I got this shirt. I'm not gonna tell you. Wait, I am gonna tell you. Old Navy, girl, $7. $7 for Old Navy Ofo Show. I couldn't believe it. I had to have it though. It is just too funny. I saw it and I said, yep. You coming home with me tonight. I was talking to the shirt. Y'all so nasty. Gosh. Yes, I was just having a little fun. Oh, yes. That's looking just beautiful, you guys. I'm happy, happy, happy. Happy, happy, happy. Remember that? What was that show called? Duck Dynasty. Mm, that was so funny back in the day. Ooh, that's hot. Don't touch that. Don't leave that door. Oh, we. I tell you what, guys. It's been a great day today. I hope, you're I hope your day was too... I hope your day too was great. Just gonna let that soup cook up and we'll be eating in no time, boys and girls. Hey, Danny Sutton, live from Athens, Georgia. You and Lamar, say hey to Lamar for me. Um, Danny, have you been eating at any good restaurants, local restaurants, while you while the quarantine's been going on? I saw one couple posts. That you and your other half have been eating out at good restaurants and coming up with creative ideas to eat out. You know, I have not been eating out much. Um Hey Courtney, welcome. Glad you made it on tonight. Um, I have not been eating out much. I went to Zaxby's on Saturday and had a salad, but um, that's about it. I don't. 
I just don't want to overdo it going out um, right now. And I've been buying hella groceries, so let me cook what I got here, you know? So, um, yeah, I went to Zaxby's and they messed up my order. I was so mad. Mm. But it's okay. That's how it goes. Sometimes you get it right, sometimes you get it wrong. Just got to move on. That's all you can do, right? Daniel, are you adding a special? <laughs> That's a good idea, Daniel. Um, unfortunately, no. It's just your um, just your average <laughs> just your average soup tonight. No special ingredients. Oh gosh, too funny. I should have done O fo twenty night. O fo twenty. Um, hey Courtney, so, yeah, not, not too much eating out, but they said it's opening up the haircuts on Friday, so everybody go out and get your haircut. Daniel, you going out to get your haircut on Friday? I mean, tell you what, people, woo, hey Matt Lamb. You are going to get your haircut on Friday? That's great. I think that'll be awesome. <clears throat> I think it's going to be a line at the hair salon on Friday. I mean, it's going to be a line like you've never seen before. You'll think, who? Well, like, what's going on? Is there a line at Starbucks? Is there a line at... Nope, it's a line to get your haircut. That's what that is. Alright y'all, I just took a little sample out, put a little piece of ice in my soup, because a little ice always just cools it down just enough to where you can really enjoy a perfect temperature. So I'm just going to just check on my veggies and see where they are and see how much longer we need to cook or not. Mmm. You guys. Mmm. Hey Chad, glad you made it on tonight. Welcome to OFO Show. OFO Show. Cooking special. Live on Facebook. Mmm. Yep. I think we're in the money right now. Mm-hmm. That's it, you guys. Mmm. I tell you what, that's some good stuff right there. Mmm. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. Appreciate it. Guys, that is so good. It's got celery, carrots, portobello mushrooms, chicken, chicken sausage, cilantro, yellow onion. Mmm. Divine. Vincent Kirk Musgrave. All right, honey. Thanks for tuning in tonight. I have just turned off the heat and I'm ready to pour me a big bowl of hot Ofo Show soup. Mmm. Oh, there's broccoli in there too. Mmm. Delicious. Mmm. Yep, that's a good one. Tell you what, guys. I wish you could be here right now because, well, I pour your bowl of soup. But if this is the best we get, then I'd say it's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Can't beat it. Well, um, that's all I have for you. Enjoy the foe. Catch you tomorrow. That sounds good, Jim. I'm going to catch you tomorrow, too. And I'll catch you tomorrow, too. Uh, enjoy your evening. I hope you have something amazing for dinner. 
And if not, go to Zaxby's. Go to Wendy's. Go somewhere. Splurge. Or support your local small business who's serving dinner. Um, that's all I have for you tonight. I hope you guys have a great night. Hey, Sheila, I'm glad you're tuning in. Catch the other 15 minutes because I'm about to sign off. But before I do go, remember to share peace and love. That's all I ask. Peace and love. Ofo show. Bye, everybody. Have a good night.